Hey, how are you, man? Tony here, Living a Thousand Fitness, coming with a fitness tip for you here, real quick for your weekend. Uh, just had a quick little tip for you today on breathing. Understand your breathing is very important to your blood transference going on inside your veins, of course, inside your cardiovascular system. So if you're holding your breath during exercises, there's no blood flow movement going from uh, your blood vein, you know, it's from your cardiovascular system, nervous system into your muscle group that you're working. So you have to make sure that the oxygen that you want to get through that bloodstream to get to those muscles is gonna get there properly. So you have to make sure you're inhaling, exhaling properly. Uh, typically, I tell my athletes, when coming towards the body, I always, I always suggest a slow inhale. The inhale is through the nose and not through the mouth. Reason being, you'll control it more coming through the nose than you will taking a big gape of air through your mouth, like such. So you wanna just inhale slowly through the nose in a smooth fashion, fill the lungs to capacity, then exhale slowly with a, and the exhale is through the mouth, not through the nose. So it's in through the nose, out through the mouth smoothly, in a nice succession, okay? So, when doing an exercise, for example. Okay, so, you're doing a leg lift. Exhale away from the body. Inhale and slow resist as you're coming toward the body. Exhale and thrust. Inhale on your way back towards the body, okay? And like I said, what this does is it pushes the blood through the bloodstream, you get that oxygen and extra things, nutrients, one, from your nervous and cardiovascular system, straight into that muscle group that you're working, and of course, the result is the pump. And that's how you know it's working properly. If you're getting blood and oxygen into your muscles, the result is typically a nice pump or an inflation of the muscle. So you gotta make sure you're doing that to make sure you get the proper nutrients and oxygen to those muscles. If not, you'll fatigue faster by holding your breath, and you'll also deplete your muscles from any nutrients that it needs during your exercise. So make sure you're inhaling properly, Inhaling when coming towards the body extremity. Exhale with your away movements. So if you're doing kick movements, inhale on the way in. Exhale on your thrust out. If you're doing press motions with your chest, fellas. And ladies, thrust, exhale through the mouth. Inhale, expand the lungs for slow resist toward the body, okay? So that's your proper breathing technique. Hopefully this has been helpful for you. If you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to leave it in the comments. Please just click subscribe on that subscribe tab down there. We really appreciate you viewing and checking out the videos and sharing. And hopefully this video has been helpful for your workout and your fitness regimen. This has been Tony here at Live at a Thousand Fitness. Hopefully you're having a great weekend out there and a great week coming forward, okay? <laughs> you know how we do it as always. Two fingers, one love. We'll see you next time. Live at a Thousand.